Well, I'm very glad in hindsight I didn't send everyone on that caravan journey yesterday, uh, which eventually I worked out what the problem was. So for whatever reason, one of the foxes was trapped behind the building. So when I was trying to send those guys with the caravan, obviously they couldn't get to it because it was trapped behind the building. Um, so what I've done is I've obviously let that out and obviously worked out the caravan was. I apologize for yesterday. I'm clearly a blind fucking idiot because there is an, a very clear thing that says how much weight bonus you get if you take animals with you on a caravan. Like for mufflops, it's like plus 70 kg or some shit like that. So I'm just blind. Uh, you were right about the pack of animals. Can definitely confirm. I'm really glad in hindsight I didn't send everybody off with this caravan though because now we are under attack and we only have Dominique, Aiden and the other guy to try and save us. Another thing to mention as well, a lot of people are saying, please don't play on Randy. We're not playing on Randy. We've been playing on Cassandra for the past two episodes now. So, um, yeah, I mean, if you've got a problem with the difficulty, it's Cassandra's fault, not Randy's fault. Although it has been a little bit easy, so I'm kind of glad we're getting a little bit more threat here. Um, this was not really what I was hoping for. I'll be honest, insects aren't a big threat, don't get me wrong, because obviously they're insects. We can generally uh, deal with them quite rapidly. Definitely need to build more turrets, though. What do you think? Should we, should we put down some right now, and that way they can build it just... Uh, what's with the copyright music immediately, my man? Come on. I apologize for yesterday's episode. I was very tilted because I've been playing CK2 and it's been really difficult recently. Our characters have just been dropping there constantly. Yesterday was no exception. Today is also not an exception to that. Today I just finished recording CK2. I'm not going to spoil it, but fucking hell, that game drives me absolutely mad. Um, right, how are we looking at this? So it's actually just these sort of early ones here. Oh, God. There's a lot of these mini little insects as well. Um, we should probably try and watch out for that a little bit, huh? Ch KO Fox 1? Chow Fox... Uh, why is there certain animal names popping up there? Oh, it's where we're trying to not shoot at them because of friendly fire. Got it, got it, cool. Right, Raptor, you can fight back. You're massive. Raptor, fight back. Raptor, please fight back. Oh my god, are you guys seeing this? That That's actually unreal. Okay, how are we doing in terms of the combat then? Still fine. We're doing okay. Good, 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 good. We can't shoot that because the Raptor Shrimp's in the way. Um, Let's just move this side, see if we can maybe kill it from that angle. How are we looking, though? Uh, it's just that one left to take out, I think. Oh, God, and of course the giant mammoth. That was not too bad. I thought that would end a lot worse than it actually did. Right, pull, pull closer. The dinosaurs are attacking the back. The raptor chimps just aren't attacking for some strange reason. Oh, God, these mammoth worms are massive, huh? Jesus. Really shouldn't have sent John and Trashy off. Again, there was no way to know that this was going to be our next sort of, uh, our next event that was going to happen. Just keep shooting. Fuck friendly fire at this point, honestly. Fuck friendly fire. Decay. Decay has indeed decayed. My poor boy. Right, run, 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 run. Look at how they massacred my boy. Um, You've got a shotgun equipped and your nail gun. That's so odd. Right, get back. We should really set the animals in hindsight. Let's go animals. Let's set them to toxic fallout. Everybody get indoors. You're not fending for yourselves. You're not defending yourselves. You're just getting yourselves fucking killed. Let's run circles around these mammoth worms. Oh, there's one down. Nice work, nice work, nice work. Okay. Get a bit closer. Oh my god, it killed that instantly. Holy shit, wow. Oh, it's actually fighting back now. And when it does fight back, it does a lot of damage. Holy shit. Right, to say that we had three people and they've managed to do it. Three of our worst shooters, actually our three worst shooters, they did a pretty good job in defending the base. I'm actually quite impressed. Let's make sure we get some more turrets down, though, so that we don't get into this scenario again. Oh, come on, where are John and Trashy, by the way? They're almost there. They're, 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 they're getting quite far through the mechanoid intrusion. Please take this last one out. Losing animals is to be expected. Losing people, I don't really mind so much. Oh, uh, sorry. Other way around. Losing animals, I don't really mind so much. Losing people is to be expected. Oh, my God. The tenant. The tenant robot is under attack. Save him. What's he wearing? He's wearing our bloody power armor. You weird man. I didn't give you permission to wear that. Right. Save his life. Get a bit closer. Save his life. Come on. Oh, we're, we're fine. We're fine. Wow. That was weird. That was, that was a weird conflict. Um, we did a lot better than I thought. Let's go like post battle analysis here. It's better than I thought. We lost one of the foxes. That was really it. And we lost one of the many, many uh, Starekosaurus, whatever the hell they were called there. Could have gone a lot better. Could have gone much, much worse to say that we had, again, three of our worst shooters here who weren't wearing armor, who have really bad weapons. Like a revolver, or a, a pair of nail guns on, on an offhand shotgun, and a garbage crucible rifle. We did a very good job there, I think. Although, well, Colonist, obviously, it was completely random for the most part. Did a very good job. Forks was the only one injured, and then it was just a slight bite on his leg, which we can obviously, uh, obviously deal with in a second there. So, for some reason, they were all trapped up here. They were all trapped up here. I don't know if they just got dropped off there when we bought them and then they were trapped. Because obviously I forbid that door. They were on the other side of the door. And obviously animals can't go through forbidden doors. So I don't know how the hell they got up there. Um, but yeah, very strange. That, that's why we didn't have access to that fox when I was trying to send a caravan off yesterday. 
Wow, that was a that was a hell of a start. This is a hell of an explosive start as well. We'll cut that up, use them as kibble, feed them to the animals that died. How are we looking here? They're actually almost there. Come on. Come on. We've got to get there as soon as possible. I only sent two people, even though it's against six enemies. It's only 1.5 days left, so I wanted to get there as, as quickly as we could. We'll just try and swipe it, get the hell out of there, because that is our AI persona core, obviously. Wow, that was um that was a hell of a start. Heat wave! Hurry! Ha <laughs> ha! Good, good. Heat wave. Luckily, the base is nicely, nicely cooled, as you can see at this stage. We've got coolers everywhere. So we should be fine. We should be fine regardless. Uh, if not, we'll just put another couple of coolers on this sort of main area, vent out some, some bathrooms while because the bathrooms aren't technically cooled because they're only in there for 30 seconds, have a shower, have, go to the toilet, whatever, get out. There's not really much point in cooling those. They're not spending a protracted period of time in there, but everywhere else we do need to uh, focus on that. This room, I guess, also isn't cooled, so I need to work on that. Um... To be fair, that's probably constructive roof, isn't it? What we could do is knock a hole through... If we go remove roof here. Actually, better plan. Better plan. Oh, yeah, we could just remove roof and vent into there. Or we could just uh, mine this couple of blocks out and then build a wall across there and use that as a sort of vent. Oh, because it's right at the map edge. Right, so we will have to do my original plan then. Never mind. All right, so we'll do that and then build a building across there. Vent out through into an open area. We could also mine this out as well for a bit more efficient heating, but in theory, it shouldn't really matter. And we are there. Pause it. Okay, caravan's here. Um, okay, it's just eight random people then, so we should be relatively safe. They look like Federation. Uh, is that what they are? Oh, they're, they're section row. Right, okay. Good luck. It's two against, two against many, so this is going to be a really messy conflict regardless. We do have those real long-range weapons, though, in the form of... Uh, Oh, man, he can actually take shot from there. My God, John. I was trying to work out how to clear that missing rally point, but it's it's for this map. It's to put a rally point for, for troops and guards and things like that. Not really important. Right, so Trashy's got the close range. John's got the long range. I think let's have John fight in the long range. Let's have Trashy focus on the ones getting a little bit closer then. That should work quite nicely. Oh, unless that happens. Bollocks. Um, run and gun, boys. Uh, don't let them get the mufflers, though. Run and gun, boys. Oh my god, he can run again with that massive fucking rifle. Are you joking? Oh god, they've already closed in. This is not a great start, is it? Fuck. Okay. Help Trashy. Help Trashy. Get in there. We've got that armor. We've got armor. They've got nothing. Come on. Take him out. Just knock him, knock him dead. Come on. Good work. Good work. Good work. Okay, focus on him next. Focus on him next. He's already injured. Take him down, boys. I believe. We've got John the Doctor there. My god, this is going to be a real messy conflict. Oh, fantastic work. Absolutely fantastic work. What are they wearing as well? Do we want to steal this? What is that? It's got some sort of like jumpsuit? Federation jumpsuit. What does it do? Uh, nothing. Nothing. It's just a guy. I thought it might give them like a work speed bonus or something. This armor. This armor though. It's doing, it's doing, it's doing God's work. Take this one down. They might flee. Come on. Take this one down. They might flee. Please, please, please. Don't die. Don't die on me. Don't you die on me. Good work. Good work. Good work. Okay. Is it just that guy left? Let's go ranged. John, flip back over. Uh, are we, are we dying? No. No damage. Okay, he's taken a lot of damage, but it's it's nothing permanent, and it's certainly nothing serious either. Right, and they've dropped medicine, so we're going to be more than fine here. Don't panic. Don't panic, Mr. Mannering. Don't you attack my bloody muffalo, you fucking psychopath. Hey, trashy killer. Are they attacking? Okay, I just want to check the others. That gun is so loud. Can we just talk about the absurdity of how loud that gun is? My God, you know when John's in the area? They're coming from a fucking mile away. It's so loud. Please. Oh, he's down. Is there anyone left? I think we've done it. That's actually it. Um, Good work. Nice work. Well done, team. Alex Lambert, is he worth recruiting? Is he worth capturing? Nudist, chemical interest, got good medical. Besides that, not really. We've got we've got a couple of good doctors already. Right, tend. Tend, my boys. Let's stick down a very quick... Uh, stand a very quick sleeping spot there. That'll do it. Let's go sleeping spot, sleeping spot. Right, medical, if you don't mind. Let's tend to trashy first. Trashy rest. Uh, let's go allow all. Boom. Tend to John. Oh god, Trashy's down. No, rescue Trashy first. Fuck. Okay. Come on. Rescue, rescue Trashy. We've been through so much together. Trashy will not die. Trashy will not die. 14 hours. I mean, Trashy will definitely not die unless I really fuck something up here. Unless there's another one that sort of does a sneak attack on us. Right, take... Patch him up. Patch my boy up. Trashy, Trashy live. Good work. Okay. That was a, that was a nice conflict. I think the armor... Is definitely the really what we have to thank there. Ten is trashy. Don't worry about it. Unless he's got medicine. Okay, we've got medicine right there. Fine. You know what? I'll allow it. Oh, the turrets. John, you're a madman. You just risk your life for trashy. He's truly a selfless and glorious man. Right. Patch him up. 
Well, that was fun. We've got ourselves a guaranteed AI Persona Core. We've got all this various sort of loot lying around here as well. That's quite nice. Uh, just to like him some cracks from knives. Lots of bruises as well. He looks a lot worse than he actually is. He looks like he's in a much worse position than, than honestly he really is at all. Right, okay. Uh, prioritize tendency yourself as well, John, before you sweep the floor. I, I appreciate you want to keep the dirt outside nice and tidy, but it's kind of unnecessary, my man. Right, there we go. Good shit. Trashy, can you pick up your... Oh, he's trying to sleep and we're interrupting. I'm so sorry. My God. Um, can't pick that up. Okay, never mind. John, take this slow. My God, man. There's a turret somewhere. There it is. What is that? Amber mini turret. It's a dinosaur turret. It's incredible. Should be able to take out from quite some range. That's so loud. That's obnoxiously loud, John. For fuck's sake. Right, a couple more shots. A couple more shots. A couple more shots and it should be dead. Please, make it end. It's so loud. I'm going to have to zoom out going on a tantrum. Do not tantrum into that turret. My god, man. Trashy, can you stand up yet? Fuck. Okay, we just have to wait. I think a muffalo's injured. It needs tending. They used an axe against a cow and only bruised it. What are they made of? What are the cows made of is my point. Holy shit. Um, his tantrum is I'm going to kick a bunch of corpses. You are a fucking lunatic. What's he shooting? What's he, what's he doing? Melee attacking auxiliary pistol. Trashy's up. Trashy, can we move you into a position take out this turret before John gets himself killed? Um, probably not, but I'm going to give it a go. Who has a medical emergency? Flint? Oh my god, Flint the... Okay, rescue, rescue our our lovely good tenant, Flint. Right, sorry, i got to focus on John and Trashy again. You're distracting me there, Flint. Trashy, if you get killed from a fucking turret, I will cry. <gasps> Come on. Trashy, it's almost dead, please. Come on, Trashy. Come on. Oh my god, this is unreal. This is unreal. Oh, he shrugged off that bullet, though, so we might be safe. Oh, great shot. 60. Come on. We only need a little bit more before it'll blow up naturally. 15. Come on. Just a tiny little bit more. Uh, Trash. Come on, man. Oh, my God. He's actually been downed. Shot in the hand. And that was enough to knock him down. John, you need to snap out of this, for fuck's sake. That snapped him out of it. He got shot. Okay. I mean, that would probably do it, wouldn't it? Rescue Trashy. Oh my god, I, I'm getting deja vu here. Very weird deja vu. At least we got enough food to get us home, guaranteed. Right, take that turret out, for fuck's sake. Boom! That's what I'm talking about. Nice work. Tend to Trashy. Get him get him fixed, and then you guys get some get some sleep. We'll, we'll go and check out that house, see if there's any beds or something there. We can even put down some sleep spots in the house just for a couple of days. Vomit all over the floor. Flint's dead. Failed your duties. Um, which journey with the Irish Flint's flint? Fuck off. Honestly, it's not my fault. It's not my fault. You can't blame us for that. Right, Trashy, whenever you're ready, come and join us in the house, my friend. Horrible, horrible day. Horrible day, but a fine encounter, actually. We didn't do too badly there. Let's go and check out what's actually inside the base, see if there's any beds or something like that. Right, claim that one. Let's claim that one, too. Gonna hope there would be, right? How, how are you guys living? Ah, oh, it's three beds. Great work. And then there should be our AI Persona Core. Very, very nice. Right, um, let's claim a couple of these beds as well, then fuck it. There we go. Uh, John, let's get you drafted and undrafted. Sorry, you go do, do what you want, my friend. Give yourself a nice meal. Trashy, when he's up, I mean, we could just rescue him preemptively, huh? That's probably probably work quite well. Go rescue Trashy. Retribution? Retribution? What is this? Bloody Caesar's Legion? Ban Wassenor have arrived nearby. Oh my. What in the shit are you talking about? Are you joking? Oh, well, luckily, a lot of it was just scrap, apparently. Um... Those are some good tactics, huh? Wow, that's um, that's a real state. Holy shit, that's a lot of people, though. And they've got some real good weapons there as well. I'm not a fan of this. What is that? Five? Ten? <sighs> okay. I can see this is this is going to go horribly. This is actually going to go so badly. Um, I was in the process of getting some more turrets dealt with. But I guess we've just got to pray this goes half decently, huh? Get into position. We're going to get massacred. We're actually going to get fucking massacred. I think everybody's going to die and we're going to lose the base at the rate we're going. Ian, uh, yeah, reinstall that stuff. But the only reason I'm reinstalling that is because I was worried that given that they're so close, if one blows up, they're all going to blow up, right? Um, can, any can anyone else work on that very briefly? Can you work on that? Yeah, that's it. Reinstall that very quickly. Thank you very much. And then get back into line. What do you mean no power? Can you not connect to it from there? Yeah, it can. We're fine. All right, here we go. Here we go. Good luck. Let's see what these sentry guns are like. Pretty good. That that's a, that seems like a pretty good a pretty good show of power to me. We need to absolutely remove remove this cover. That's that's kind of driving me a bit mad. Okay. Good luck, boys. Oh, great great start. Absolutely great start. Good good shooting here and there. 
Oh, you've already been shot in the head. Well, I, I meant good shooting for the enemy. Let's pull you back a little bit. I mean, we're, we are so heavily relying on these turrets. It's actually kind of unreal. Um, Go and deal with this guy. Oh, God, you are getting shredded. All of my colonists are getting fucking annihilated here. S you're having a heart attack. You're having a heart attack in the middle of combat? It's a Walter situation all over again. It's a Walter situation all over again. It's that bloody adrenaline mod. It's that fucking adrenaline mod killing my colonists again. Come on, please. Please, just just try and win. Just, just try. Just try. For fuck's sake. These turrets are actually doing a good job. I, I, I joke, but they're doing... A, they've downed a couple of people. We've killed a couple as well. Why are you shooting so badly? My god, I just watched his shotgun hit the tower. Fucking good god, man. And again. Unreal. How can anyone be this bad at shooting? He's right there. Kill him dead. Shit. This is un... I'm... <laughs> These turrets are not going to last much longer, are they? Oh, they're getting peppered. Just take him down. Kill him dead. He's right there. Come on. Incredible. 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 Right, 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 right. Okay, so they've got to be close to fleeing now, huh? That's like three of them downed. Okay. This turret's going to blow up, so don't stand too close to that. Can we... I mean, we need to rescue you. Rescue him. Oh, God. What does that mean? The barrel's out already? Oh, my God. The barrel's out already. Great. Okay. So now we've just got to rely on these two to try and save the colony. Great. I mean, if you do it, congratulations, but I feel like this is a fucking lost cause. Please kill him. Or I beg of you, just shoot the man in the head. Good good work, good work, good work. Come on. Get this man's foot. They might leave. They might flee if we do this. They actually genuinely might flee if we do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Medical emergency. I'm well aware. Where are you carrying him to? Oh my god, he's taking him down to the hospital. You're a fool. Stop it. It's for guests now. Take him the other way. Take him, take him to his bed for fuck's sake. Drop. Rescue. Go. Oh my god, we're doomed. Why are you... No. <laughs> Please, for the love of God, work with me here. Okay. I think we're fucked. I think we're actually kind of screwed. It's a lot ridiculous. They'll just drop their fling. Oh my god. Um, We might just get through this. We might just get through this. He's dead. Heart attack? Oh, right, from his adrenaline rush. Got it. Died of his heart attack. Fuck it. I mean, I'm sorry to that person, but what the hell else could I have done there? We're already fighting. I mean, half the colony is incapable of combat. And those turrets apparently last all of about two fucking seconds. We would have out of steel or Play-Doh, for God's sake. Trashy and John, I'm never letting you leave the colony again. We can't do it. Unless I sink all my bloody resource into defenses. And these guys just dropped on our head as well. And they're not leaving. Get out of my base. Leave. Run. Go. You're done. This man's dying in three hours. Can we take him as a prisoner? Is he any good? He's actually quite good. Bloodlust, steadfast, kind. He's actually very good. Um... What can we use as a prison, though? Oh, for God's sake, get out of here. Now following Trashy. Great, really, really appreciate that. Can this be a prison? It's not sealed, though. Ah, oh, shit. Um, John's room is a prison now. John's room is a prison, if we can save him, that is. We've got enough people to save already. Who's a doctor? Who's our best doctor? <laughs> Teresa. Okay, Teresa. You're up, boy. Let's get you in here. Rescue Aiden. Rescue Aiden. Aiden's our priority, because he's obviously a, a colonist who's contributed a lot. Get him down. You get you get basic doctor care. Okay, you capture. Let's get you. Oh my god, it's so laggy trying to use the mouse to pan around the map. You capture him. I think he's probably going to die. I'll be, I'll be completely honest with you. We're not wasting our medicine on him, definitely. Right, tend to him. Save his life. 11 hours. He should be good. He should be good. We, we probably should have focused on the prisoner first, to be completely frank. Why have we still got combat going on? You said you would flee. Please leave. Please leave my base. You don't have to shoot my turrets. They're dead, okay? If you start shooting at him, I'm going to be so annoyed at you. Get out of here. Fuck off out of my base. Right, how are you doing? He's actually going to be fine. My god, that was close. Okay, Teresa, get in here. Get in here and rescue seedlings. That was horrible. I know, I'm, I'm so annoyed that we've gone from having barely any raids to like a few insects turning up to 10 people in drop pods. Absurd. That's, that's like a crazy difficulty spike out of nowhere. Right, bring him over. Hopefully we can save this guy's life. That would be, that'd be very, very nice. Right, drop him down. Rescue and tend to. No, no, no. You don't need to use medicine on him. Please. He's not worth it. Ch she. She's not worth it. Tend. Go. Dead. It's fine. It's fine. I'm not I'm not bitter. I'm not completely fucking annoyed in every conceivable way. 
Bring Trashy and John home, for fuck's sake. I should have never let them go. I should never send both of them off. There always needs to be a Stark in Winterfell. Send them back. Good God. I'm going to stop off still on the mechanoids on the way home, because we're, we're kind of there already, huh? Reform the caravan. Send them all. Shit, that's so annoying. Um, we can actually ride them for the time being, at least until we get to the mechanoid intrusion. Right, send that shit. Tend to, we got so much food. Uh, take the AS Persona calls. Take the steel, because we're only going to the other place to steal steel anyway. Um, take a solar panel or two, if you felt like it. What's the mass? We've still got so much weight left. Fuck it. We'll go there. No. Uh, what's the quickest way home? What's the quickest route home? Because we're going to be going through the mechanoids anyway. Right, right, right. So go there first. So remove that waypoint. Go there first. 0 0.4 days. Should be there in no time. Well, this has been a stressful day already. Okay, we're about to arrive at the hive. Then we should be able to get back home. Maybe during the same day. I'm not entirely sure. Right, set up camp. Man, this is, um, I, I, I mean, like I said, I just recorded the world's most stressful episode of CK2, so I was kind of like, let's go do some remote, do some research, chill out, be nice and casual. My god, it's been unrelenting. It's been absolutely unrelenting today. Um, what have we got on the map? Then? Let's just sort of pan around here. We've got a couple of, like, beds. We've got some freezers, apparently, which is kind of strange. Didn't know mechanoids, uh, were a particularly fan of, uh, refrigerated food there. What a messy map, my god. Okay. Get to work then, boys. You know the drill. Let's get all of this stuff deconstructed as quickly as we can possibly muster. I mean, John and Trash should be both quite good at doing that. There are actually some beds. So if we do end up staying the night, they can share a nice bed there as well. High-tech goods trader. My god, please have some sort of guns or anything to trade with me. You're more than welcome to the colony at this point, my friends. I see these guys thought they might have some more dinosaurs for sale. Please. Uh, they've got a big old, big old kangaroo. Fuck it. I'll buy your big old kangaroo. We are building a zoo here after all. Um, besides that, Mutus Syringe, Mutus Serum... Uh, okay, cool. Uh, again, we can't really do much with that right now. Blueprints implant, we got jade, old computer, bamboo, modded computer, modded computer out of bamboo, huh? Um, nothing really there then. So these guys are good for selling like mechanoid chips and, and just sort of various high tech stuff. I guess it just picks data from the, from the far side of the research tree and just, they just sell a random assortment of that because obviously they're all from various different mods. The androids themselves are from the androids mods. So it seems a little weird that they would sell all that random crap. Let's not worry about it for the time. Did we actually buy the kangaroo? Did I forget to do that? Whoops. Um, sorry, come back and, uh, who, who was that? Who was, who was doing the training net? Come back and buy the kangaroo for me. We've got to at least get something for this zoo, right? That should be the last of the ship chunks decomposed in this area then. So let's quickly, uh, that's looking all right to me. So now we want to set them as not riders potentially just so that we can get more weight on them. So no riders, no riders. Uh, sorry, no, no riders. There we go. 490 kilograms. Right, that should bring home a lot of stuff then. 124 components is taking about half of that. Let's bring all the steel. Oh my god, we can bring all the steel as well. Let's bring the chem fuel, which I assume the mufflers have produced. My god, look at this. Holy shit. Bringing home two solar generators, AI Persona Core, 520 steel, 124 components, 343 chem fuel. Is there anything else we want to bring home with us? Um, try and bring home the... No, the refrigerator is far too heavy there. Uh, cooler? We can almost find use for a cooler. Send them home. It's going to take 1.2 days to get there, because obviously we are massively weighed down, like, like ridiculously... What do you mean a new area has been revealed? Where? What are we talking about? I don't like that, but I don't know what they're talking about, so we'll ignore it for the time being. Oh, our dinosaur's down. Must be, must have been hunting there. Well, this has been, uh, this has been something already. Should we get some more turrets? I feel like we need a bit more of a permanent defense. Right now, they're all immediately heading over to the research lab, so I'm thinking we build a big old wall just across the front here, try and curve it somewhat, and then have that lined with turrets and embrasures and whatever else. Just because the lab is so delicate and, and like open to raiders to be able to just go and quickly attack. Um, yeah, how do we want to go about this then? We could do a layer of walls or sandbags, have a big old entrance over to this area, maybe do it perfectly diagonally. I don't entirely know the best way to do it. Um, just pure diagonal embrasures maybe might work. Marble? Oh my god, this is going to look so hideous, but I love it. Okay, let's, let's give this a go. So let's do something like, um, I mean, if it's going to be L-shaped, where's our... So our middle ground is going to be straight up through there. Sorry, I'm, I'm running some maths here. Okay, that could work. Just just basic trimming. Okay, that's fine. Let's, let's give this a go. Stop it. Please, we're almost home. Please, for the love of God, don't do this. What are we up against? One man. The man himself. Wingnut with his mohawk. Okay, you are you are done for, Wingnut. You are. I, I don't know who you thought you were ambushing, my friend. But we just went and stole an AI power core and then invaded a mechanoid hive. You're in the wrong neighborhood. You're actually in the wrong neighborhood. Uh, maybe run and gun. Take him down. I, I mean, just... It didn't even stand... Like, the second shot from Trashy's gun. He was done for. Right. Thank you for that interruption. Very unnecessary. Get us out of here. Get fucking out of here. Come on, take it. Is that everything? We're taking everything with us? Um, yeah, we are. Oops, sorry. I meant to <laughs> I meant to reform caravan there so that we could go home. 
All right, when these guys are back, we can actually finally crack on with things there. Um, I really probably should bury you rather than just letting you get eaten. What I'm really annoyed by is that tenant turned up, wore our power armor, and then died in it. So now we need to craft a new set of power armor to make up for the... Oh, two new sets of power armor to make up for the fact... Oh, no, because he was wearing his. Yeah, just a whole new set. The helmet and the body there. To make up for the fact that we just lost that one. Very annoying. Um, yeah, I might as well just go ahead and queue those up uh, in advance before I forget. Protective helmet, protective gear, absolutely. Make a bunch of anti-met rifles as well. It might not be the best idea to fill everybody out with those, but they're so, so long range. We give us such a tactical advantage against them as well. Then if they get close, switch to your melee weapons. We'll make sure everyone gets a good melee weapon on the secondary as well, rather than just having tools, because that might not favor us too well. The colony has been set so far back because we haven't had our other two guys there. And what's everyone doing right now? Working on the massive wall. Yeah, I'm planning out a massive wall, by the way. It's just all embrasures. Um... How are we doing? You're sad because... Here's something else we can't work out. Common sense keeps... Like, okay, this guy, watch this. He's in bed, and then occasionally, he'll wake up, clean shit up, and then go back to bed. And it's actually kind of driving me mad. I might be tempted to disable common sense again, because I feel like they're wasting a shitload of time doing unnecessary jobs. So that might be... That might be one thing I'm dropping from the mod list, but... Yeah, getting these embraces up as soon as possible, that is going to be our top priority for now. Make sure we've got decent, strong defenses. Particularly if, you know... Ten guys in drop pods can drop on our head at any second. That's not nice. To God, if you two start resting there, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna have arguments. We're gonna fight. Just get back to the base. Thank you. Okay. Oh man, the heist has returned. That is a shitload of steel, a shitload of components, and more importantly, the hour personical, which is massive. That's huge for us. Going forward, especially with some of the research which requires it as well, that's gonna be so, so, so significant. Are you all right? Are you, are you good? You're not, you don't seem very good. Hand cannon, battle rifle. Oh, our friend, your friends shot you. Got it. That makes perfect sense. The base is a shit tip. Needs tidying up. We need to finish all the skylights as well. There's so much work to be done. I'm, I'm going to try and get as much of the skylights done before tomorrow, as, uh, uh, like in between episodes, just very quickly. It's only building skylights. You guys don't, definitely don't need to see that. We definitely don't need to leave it in here. There's so much other stuff to look at. Remember when I promised we'd start with the dinosaur research, and then we've just been pelted with toxic fallouts and raids and black hive attacks and everything else we had a couple we had like an episode of peace and now it's just really come back and hit super super hard again this wall though this wall is definitely going to change things for us now bear in mind it could be used against us as well so we need to put some sort of trench some sort of traps at the front of these walls so that enemies don't use the embrasures against us because that's the worst case scenario right there we go. Balance and peace is restored within the round. We've got Ian quickly tidying things up. We've got John and Trashy working on the skylights as if nothing's ever changed. Besides the fact that we have a mountain of just components now. This incredible stuff. So I guess our next big long-term research then after the animal feeders will be carrying on with our... Oh, that's actually it for the dinosaurs. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, then. I will admit, I am very tempted to go into the... Um, into the bionics and specifically the advanced... Organs, I think it's called, isn't it? The the the, uh, the thing that we installed on Trashy, just because they seem so incredibly powerful. The next big thing is to build a hotel and actually have actually have a dedicated area for guests. So I'm thinking we go for furniture. We build a big old hotel. All we've got to do then is build some animal enclosures because we've got the automated feeders down and we have ourselves our dinosaur hotel version 1.0, right? So I just want to get some sort of decent area for them to shop in and for them to and actually sort of management as well would be would be very very nice just to ensure we've got the right level of dinosaurs and you know all of that type of stuff um oh also septic tanks and water filtration it occurred to me we actually don't have any way right now of building a way to dispose of waste all we have to do is um all we have to do is just sort of plummet away to somewhere pump it into a river or something we started with both a septic tank and the water tank so we never had to worry about this so again this on the list should be a uh, like a definite we never actually bothered researching sewage after that then we'll go for our furniture make the best hotel possible make multiple layers of it like i said jade hotel it's always a dream after that we should be good I think after that, we can we can potentially open the park for business in a more more long-term way. You know, enable guests with Orion's Hospitality mod. Broadcast some tenancy invites, things like that, and actually see what people think of our park. Is that? It's another cursed letter. Group of tribespeople from the Pact of Bobo Bay have arrived nearby. How many? Oh, my God. Can I leave this for... This is unbelievable. Um, right, so we've only got four people capable of combat now. Incredible. Glad that we've already gone forward in, in the way that we have. All right, the wall is nowhere near finished. Like, not even remotely started on that one. I really should flip that over to uh, chiseling blocks rather than quarrying resources. We've got enough to finish this off. Shit, this could be a concern. At least we've got John and Trashy and Dominique and Aiden this time rather than just the, the, the other three. Let's get them equipped. Their power armor It's right there. It's lying around. It's ready to go. Oh, man. This is uh, this is really something to end the episode on, huh? You ready? We really want me to end it with this, right? Get that, get that, get that equipped. Let's equip that one as well. And then we're missing a helmet. Ah. Uh, Missing a helmet somewhere. 
Doesn't really matter too much. A helmet to helmet at the end of the day. Right, can we get that equipped then? Are we going to be able to be equipped and ready to go before these guys turn up? Almost certainly not. Oh, shit. This is concerning. Oh, God. John, John, John. We need you We need you done first. How, how are we doing? How are we doing? He's ready. He's ready to go. Right, get him out here. Draft him up. Get him out here. Right, who's next? Who's going to be next? Trashy. Hurry. The turrets have already spotted them, so clearly they're right outside. Oh, God. I don't even want to look. Honestly, don't even want to look at this point. Right, Trashy is good and ready to go. Get him out here. Get him out here. Animal needs treatment. Don't worry about that. It doesn't matter too much. Right, John, get in position. Fantastic shot there. Take that guy down before he injures the turret. John, I believe. Not really a great start. Muffalope 3 is dead. Oh, good lord. Muffalope 3. That's an early one, huh? Trashy, where are you? Trashy's on his way. Dominique, you are also ready to go. Get out here. Uh, Aiden doesn't have a helmet regardless. Get him out here. This is horrible. Actually kind of horrible that we're going to get so many raids now so quickly. I don't know why we're getting so many raids so violently all of a sudden. The Raptor Shrimp actually did something this time. He actually killed a man. Great work. Um, do you deal with him? Sick people hiding behind this fucking power plant. Oh, God. That's not good. Nice. There goes another dinosaur. Sick of this happening. Get out of here. Great devourer. Help me out, my man. Good work. Help out Dominic. That's, that's, some nice, that's some nice sights right there. Right. You get here. How are we looking? Oh, my God. They've lit fire to the base. Forks, what the fuck? Muffalo 1 is dead, by the way. <laughs> Great. Alright, let's just try and get him to flee then. Let's just try and get him to flee at this point. Uh, yeah, you move closer. I don't know. Melee attack that, get into combat something. My god, what a state this has become, huh? This is, this is completely out of hand. The fire already is kind of a little bit absurd. Forks is down. Oh, there's the other power arm helmet. You're right. But now in eight hours. Well, you're dying in a hospital, so it could be a lot worse, couldn't it, really? I'm sick of, I'm, I'm moving this power plant. They're just hiding behind it. They're actually just hiding behind it and using it as cover. It's unreal. Right, you also get in there. Save that muffalo. Please don't let that one blow up, for God's sake. Otherwise, it's a whole base with it. Trash has been shot. They're fleeing. All right. Wow. Another pretty ridiculous raid there. We came out of that very, very... Oh, is that their bloody pet jaguar or something? Get out of here. Very, very fortunate there. Search and destroy. Kill whatever's left. Bloody hell. That was, um, I didn't, I wanted to finish on that one because I did not want to load into this tomorrow and start by fighting off a goddamn raid, huh? All right, there we go. I think we're fine. Let's go rescue. Let's make sure, John, let's go and get you to rescue Forks again. Dying in a hospital, probably the perfect place for it, really. There we go. Good as new. You'd never even know you've been shot multiple times. Perfect. Okay. Thanks, John. Again, common sense. Bit pointless doing that after you've already cleaned up the fucking base, but that's all right. We got a couple of animals that were damaged. Oh, survivor, you any good? You are pretty good. Uh, capture... Oh my god, do we have any unreserved beds? N Trashy? <laughs> Trashy, I'm so sorry. You've been through so much. Uh, what about our people? Uh, eight conditions, ten one condition. So just bruises, cuts, generally. Nothing nothing that we have to worry about urgently. Capture them. Death in three hours. Chance they're going to die when the adrenaline wears off anyway. But we will try and take a prisoner and recruit them. Can't really see it working, but hey, we might as well give it a goddamn go. Uh... Get him down, get him down, and then, and then quickly, quickly, Dr. Kett, quickly, John. John is an incredibly good doctor, so this should... Uh, all of our muffalos are exploding. A little bit annoying. We've got plenty to go around, so it's not a big deal. Oh my god, they're actually going to be fine. Holy shit. Prisoner, recruit him. Oh my god, that good... Yeah, good luck with that one. That one's going to be fun. Well, um, a fun way to end it. How many animals have we got left? Because I feel like our zoo's sort of d degraded somewhat. Still got two male muffalos. We've still got two female muffalos. Oh my god, is that all we've got left? Fuck. They did so much damage to the base, just the amount of muffalos they killed. Christ. Everything else is fine. We've got a Maiku Colossus. We've got a Strikosaurus. Um, uh, sure, welcome. Jo join us, my friend. Disease infection. Forks has got an infection. Not really much of a shocker there. We've got so many people to tend to as well. We've got tend to John. We've got tend to Trashy. Like I said, I mean, CK2 kind of drove me mad today. And then coming, to, coming into this, th these games have got it in for me. This, is, this, this day has raised my blood pleasure more than any other day I can remember recording in ever. Thank you for watching. Let's leave that there before I actually capitulate. Thank you to Aiden W, Alpha Scuff, Anthony Gawley, Asuna Kurato, Atmos, Average Gamer 419, Bacon Kitten, Sidini, Crazy Pack, Croesus, Donald, Emerald Bean, Pacuna Vasquez, Fluffernutter, Ghost Protocol, Gogolus, Harik, Harik, what? Why twice? Jimbo, Jonah Waters, Josh Lindeen, Tesla, Justin Wallace, Kenny Carter, Michael Mullen, Musk, Grapful, Natbuskus, Number One, Nathan Flores, Necrofen, and Powers Presley, Richard Clark, Rodin, Scott, Skaz, Somnus, Stannis the Manus, Shayok, Swain, The Forsaken One, T-Bag Cruz, Tom Terry 18, Tyler Kendall, Vacuous Backus, and William Green for their support at the Insane Lovers on Patreon. Thank you for supporting the channel. Thank you for helping me out. I need more help than this, though. I need, I need to see a, a therapist, a psycho, just everything. I'm getting PTSD on behalf of my Rimworld characters. Thank you to Irish why have we started halfway down the list? 
Thank you as well to Astro and in person, Andrew Walsh, Andrew Wilson, Attila, Austin Taylor, Paul Doom, Ben Trope, Erasmus Max, Better Valerian, Black Double H, Chris, Corey CA, David Van Diepen, Don, Dunk, Connie 27, Easy to Pronounce, Name, Eric Farrell, Exploding Knees, Foosh, Fraser Brennan, Gabriel Van Ders, Gaz, Genji Zerka, Gompo, Gray, Haji Demar, Henrik Stensgaard, Icarus, Icy the Great, Ida, Irish, Jay Lara, Jacob Wolfie, James Barnes, James Shea, Jason Sushu, Jose, Yoran DeVries, Jessica Smith, John Holiday, Jordan Campbell, Joseph Beer, Justin Plock, Justin Walters, Luana Thomas, Mastolp, Luke Wallace, Monty, Nathaniel Lindberg, Nick, Noah Gallimore, Pan Samu, Panther Pearl, Payback 1 through 7, Peyton Dennisar, Rodrigo, Russian Oligarch, Billionaire, Brian Hooper, Smirt One, Spencer Powell, Socrates, Super Nanny Zero, 8 9, The Bloody Knight, The Insane Pickle, Volonkari, Baragon, Voodoo Member, Wesley Grayson, Will Wade, Wilson, Atef, Wolfie, Yorka, Sack, and Zico 2. To all the other patrons, to all the subscribers, to all the everybody who's ever supported the channel, thank you. See you guys tomorrow. I need a bloody good night's sleep after this. Good God.